Hi, I'm Mary, a librarian and book reviewer with a focus on stories written for kids, tweens, and teens. Today, I get to share with you this book called The Bayside Bunch, Breathing is Believing, written by Dr. Unseld Robinson and illustrated by Mike Motz. This is a story that takes place during the COVID shutdown. So all of the students in the school are learning virtually. So they've got a virtual class that is coming up and they are all learning about the importance of connecting and breathing, especially through challenging situations. So within the community, something challenging has happened and breathing was directly um, involved in that event. So the principal has sat everyone down, taught them how to take deep, quiet breaths in order to kind of reground themselves when they find themselves in a difficult situation. So that leads to discussion about the civil rights movement, research project that goes along with that, and then a chance for kiddos to be involved in student government and learn about the right uh, to use your voice and vote and have your voice be heard. So this story is great for elementary school age readers because a lot of these concepts are things that they are learning in school. So there's a lot more conversation now about how to breathe, how to be more mindful in your activities, especially at a young age because anxiety is really uh, settling in with our community. Um, and so you see in the images, lots of families working together for this to happen. Um, and then you have relationships among each of the characters. So these characters are the same from each of the Bayside books to each other. So as you get to know this series, you get to know more of the characters um, and you'll get to see them in positive uh, situations with role models and positive relationships between them and the teachers in their lives. Um, so as you can see, there is a fair amount of text on each page, but it's not super intimidating. So for readers who are in elementary school, this is a pretty accessible story, um, not only because of the way that it is delivered, but also because of the content behind it. So as students are going through their own studies of civil rights movements, voting, etc., they will find a connection here. And current uh, elementary school age readers will also remember what it was like to learn virtually, and this is a um, the story that will remind them of that time. So as you're going through, you also see that the pictures are bright, colorful, easy to see from a distance. So this is a story that can easily be read in a classroom setting um, so that kiddos can see all of the pictures. And at the end, there is a glossary that goes over some of the maybe more unfamiliar terms that are used within the story. So it's a good way to uh, expand the learning that is happening as kiddos are reading this book. So if this sounds like a great fit for you, Breathing is Believing, I hope you look for it at your favorite bookstore.